it's that time again to look into what's new at the Dollar Tree this week. I found so many things that there might be a two-parter to this video. But first up are these Crayola again. Are, are they Pips Squeaks Skinnies? Now they actually made these in a really interesting set a couple years ago and I did a throwback to them, but they have these skinny markers now. If you love coloring, make sure you're checking out the coloring book section every time that you go to the Dollar Tree because they're always putting out new books. This one caught my eye. As you know, I actually prefer children's coloring books, but this adult coloring book was very cute and I think it's a must if you love coloring. Shooketh to my core. But look at all of these new wall decors, and there were so many. I've never seen Dollar Tree put out so many decor items that were kind of in the same family. That cactus one is the best one in my opinion. I love the mermaid next as well, but they're all so beautiful, and they're glittery, and the flamingo, oh my goodness. I just was shocked to honestly see these at Dollar Tree. When I saw these white picture frames, I had to dig into my memory because I thought, I don't think I've ever seen white picture frames at Dollar Tree before. To me, I think this is new. I'm very impressed. I've seen a lot of picture frames here lately, and this white one is amazing because the options to decorate are endless and perfect for Christmas time and any holiday, really. And this one is shocking as well. It's very farmhouse. It looks like it just came from Hobby Lobby. So if you have a shabby chic or a farmhouse, country cottage, rustic feel, they have these gorgeous picture frames at Dollar Tree now. This right here, I'm, I like, you should see me convulsing right now. This is probably one of the most exciting items to come through Dollar Tree. These very cute mason jars that are also a piggy bank. And the decorations, the colors, everything is perfect. I love what they've done. Now I've seen these similar style come out before with the clear like glass top or plastic top with the words but it was a black frame and now they have the white and it is really beautiful so you can really now mix up your decor whether you use black more if you use white more and it says wine o'clock then I saw dream and I saw relax. I was really happy to see that they're constantly putting out some of the same things but in different styles. And who caught those pineapples to the side? Are these not gorgeous? Gold, silver, and the white. Again, so much potential here from decorating purposes. And this is just stunning. So if you're into pineapples, they have these gorgeous things there. I'm so shocked. So, so shocked. I have to get over this. Dollar Tree's always putting out new little photo albums that fit four by six pictures. Don't forget to check those out as well because they're putting out new prints. And they first started off with just solid colors and now this? Stunning, gorgeous, I love it. One dollar. Like, can we just... I feel like I'm robbing the place blind. So I've actually seen some of these little, like, decor, you know, word pieces, but they've always been kind of a finished product, so I wasn't sure what to kind of make of this. It kind of has, like, they painted some parts of it, but then it just looks very, just you know, just like you would have to you know, add your own paint and your own stuff. So if that's an option to kind of, you know, build your own decor up from scratch, this is really cute and they had different words to choose from as well. Now who remembers when I used to haul these little night lights and they had like the princess themes? Oh my goodness. I haven't seen those because it's been years, but they have some new ones and they have the My Little Pony, the Despicable Me, and I even saw Frozen. Now I haven't been looking at these in a while, but they're new to me but they might have been around for a while. I found some new water bottles and the prints are really beautiful. I love, I don't know if it's like paisley, but it's just really pretty prints with even a chevron option too. And they're BPA free, which you know I love. So again, I started this series just because there's so much to look at at Dollar Tree, but there are a lot of things that I really just don't need. So I realize that some of this may not actually be new new this week, but it's kind of new to me and I'm sort of playing catch up. And I want to point out the band-aids. I just think that's crazy. I remember when I was little and I wanted like the cool fun Scooby-Doo band-aids and they have Shopkins, they have My Little Pony, the Minions, the Emojis, Jurassic Park, which is very trendy right now. I don't know what PJ Masks is, but they look pretty pretty popular, and the band-aids are just completely adorable. Completely adorable. 
Dollar Tree has put out temporary hair color before, but I've never seen this packaging and all they had was teal and pink. Comment down below and let me know what other colors. I feel like purple is the color I'm missing, but guess what? I bought both of them. New patterns alert. They finally, finally have put out new patterns after years, but you guys know how much I love these headbands and the washcloth. I have them, I've hauled them before, and these, this pattern is beautiful. I love the pastel baby blue and that lavender. Just beautiful, and of course I bought some because you know how I am. I thought this nail grooming kit was definitely worth a mention in my What's New series. Look at the cuteness of these butterflies, but truth be told, I didn't actually check to see any other patterns. I was in a hurry, but the butterflies were very cute. I thought this was another exciting find. Again, the Sassy and Chic line. This is the fashion nail files, but with a case. I thought that was so genius. Great to throw in your purse, great for traveling, which I'm taking with me to the beach, and all the patterns. I love the options. That's one of my favorite things that Dollar Tree does, is giving us options. Now they've been carrying around the Dermasil brand, but I haven't seen this specific like night and day cream. I thought that was very interesting with vitamin E, which is really great for your skin. And I had to mention this, of course, in my what's new. I'm always waiting for them to put out some really good scented sprays. And these were really interesting. I actually didn't really like very many of them. I liked the vanilla brown sugar and the citrus and coconut. I thought those were the two best smelling, but I have to say that apple cinnamon girl smells like fall. It's really lovely. I just, cinnamon gives me a headache. The next item that I feel like is new, but I may have seen it in the last week or two, maybe even a little bit longer, but it's just now making into my video, are these personal care wet wipes. The packaging is really beautiful, although I know it shouldn't be about the packaging when it comes to wipes, but it says pre-moistened antibacterial wipes. Uh, selling for a dollar, these would be great for traveling, throw it in your purse. Um, definitely don't leave it in your car for the summertime. It'll, it, if you're in Texas, it'll get way too hot. But I think I'm going to definitely grab this for traveling. Having Kleenex is nothing new, but the fact that there's a Kleenex brand at Dollar Tree, I feel like is kind of new. I've only ever seen like that Scotty's brand or just off brands. I've never seen a name brand Kleenex. So I thought that was worth a mention and I grabbed one to throw in the car for traveling as well. Now I've seen Dollar Tree put out name brand like little, you know, little chapsticks, but I've never seen quite a collection like this before. I was so blown away. This definitely takes me back to the 80s a little bit just because all the like chapsticks and lip glosses were always like, you know, candy scented. And so this kind of makes me feel nostalgic. The Mike and Ikes, the Blow Pop, the Gushers. The Gushers was probably my favorite and the Blow Pop was my favorite. I should have bought some to try them out, but comment down below and let us know if you have and if they're good quality. Brand new soap alert. I am loving the packaging too, by the way. The one on the right definitely makes me feel Golden Girls. Blanche's bedroom, I would imagine this is what she would have in her bathroom. So I, I saw this body wash and it instantly made me realize, okay, this is new. I've never really seen this before. So I got on my phone to kind of see if this is selling for something else. I saw it on eBay for going about $14, but then I also saw it from Dollar Tree. Um, so comment down below, let us know if it's value somewhere else at other stores, but otherwise I thought this was an interesting find as well. And the very last thing for today's video is this hippo bubble maker. I also found it in a frog. I just thought it was definitely so cute and worth putting it in my video. I don't have any little kids to buy for, at least my niece. Maybe I'll get this for her when she's a little bit older, but I thought this was really, really cute and just crazy that you can buy bubble makers for $1. Like I wish I would have had so many toys if we had a Dollar Tree back then. And that's it for this video. I hope that you guys are loving my new What's New at Dollar Tree series. Please give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you really soon for another video. Bye girls.